Welcome to in 5 minutes. The agenda of this clip is to understand the effect of constant field scaling on various parameters of a MOS transistor. As we have seen in the previous clip that in constant field scaling, all the parameters including the voltages are scaled down by a factor of S. If you would remember the table, the pictorial diagram is just a representation of what we did in the table. We can see that the doping density increases by a factor of S in order to maintain the charge field relationship. The thickness oxide gets reduced by a factor of S. The length and the width of the channel are also reduced by a factor of S. The junction depth is also reduced by a factor of S. Let's go ahead and see what is going to happen on some of the different parameters with constant field scaling. Let's start with oxide capacitance. We all know that oxide capacitance is given by COX equal to permittivity of the oxide layer upon the thickness oxide TOX. If I change this oxide after scaling it will read something like this permittivity which is a constant factor upon TOX. Now since we know that after scaling TOX is nothing but TOX by S so we can very easily write this is nothing but equal to S permittivity by TOX which is nothing but S into COX. So what we see is the oxide capacitance increases by a factor of S. This is going to be very very critical. Let's go ahead and see how. Let's understand the gate capacitance in a MOS transistor in constant field scaling. We know that the gate capacitance CG is given by oxide capacitance COX into the width of the channel into the length of the channel. After scaling, we know that all the parameters are going to be scaled. So let's change it. And we just recently saw that oxide capacitance increases by a factor of S. Width and length, we know, are going to be reduced by a factor of S. So when we substitute this, what we get is S into COX into W by L upon S square. So when we cancel off the S, what we get is after scaling the gate capacitance is nothing but before scaling divided by S. We have understood that the gate capacitance reduces by a factor of S. This is going to be so important and we'll see how is this going to change the delay and the frequency of operation of a circuit as we go ahead in the clip. The next parameter which we would like to understand is equation or I would say current in the linear region. So we know that the equation of the current in the linear region is given by transconductance which is nothing but mobility into oxide capacitance by 2 W by L. We have already studied this formula in the past twice VGS minus the threshold voltage into VDS minus VDS square. Now we know that in constant field scaling, what's going to happen is COX is going to increase by a factor of S. Width and length are going to be reduced by a factor of S. The voltages, all voltages, yeah, all voltages are also going to be scaled down by a factor of S. Let's replace all these terms in the above equation. Mind you, the variation in the mobility is very, very negligible in both the types of scalings and hence it can be easily neglected. So we can find out here that ID dash, which is nothing but ID linear after scaling is nothing but now straight away let's substitute rather than writing the terms which are scaled down with a dash. Mobility remains the same, 2 is a constant. Oxide capacitance, we just saw that it increases by a factor of S. W and L are both getting reduced by S so they will cancel out each other. So we'll just write W by L, 2. Now all these voltages are also going to be scaled down by a factor of S, even VDS. I'm sorry, that's a minus sign. VDS square, if it's a square, it will be reduced by a factor of S square. So that is nothing but, if you see properly, ID linear and we'll take this S square common outside the bracket. So it's nothing but S into ID linear upon S square which is nothing but ID linear divided by S. So we see in constant field scaling that the linear region current reduces by a factor of S. This is going to be so critical when we discuss power dissipation which will come in the following clip.